With 76 minutes gone of today's game at Cuthbury between Wimborne Town and Polton Rovers, the score stood at 1 0 to Polton Rovers, a Polton team who hadn't conceded a goal in over 10 hours of league football. It was clearly going to take something special to break that deadlock. Step up Jamie Davidson. The inside forward for Wimborne collected the ball and from 30 yards unleashed an absolute screamer past, past Phillips in the Polton goal to make it 1 1. At that, that stage, it was no more than Wimborne deserved for a second half that they dominated. And they could have gone on to win it in the, in the minutes remaining, although probably a draw was a fair result. With Jordan Cole unavailable, Steve Cuss brought in Matt Deer at left back. And Taffy, Taffy Richardson going back to Pool Town gave George Webb a chance to reclaim his, his place in the starting lineup. But it was the visitors who started the game on the front foot and they were clearly the better team for the first 15 minutes. Although, on 10 minutes, a good free kick from Alex Parsons would just have needed a touch from Tom Jeffs to put the Magpies ahead. But it was on 24 minutes that James Billing put the visitors ahead when he fastened on to a through ball and placed the ball neatly past the, past the rushing uh, Jason Harbour. Now that's the way it stayed till half time with Poulton well worth a 1-0 lead. The second half was a completely different affair. Wimborne got onto the front foot, started closing players down, much as they had at Bridgewater on Tuesday night, and Poulton were strangely uh, lethargic, and it was Wimborne who were on the ascendancy now. Matt Kemble came on for Matt Deer on 66 minutes, and then 10 minutes later, Davidson unleashed his screamer for the equaliser. Poulton were clearly rattled. Four minutes later, Nick Dunn was sent off for retaliation and Bolton were down to 10 men. Wimborne could have scored the winner in the 14 minutes remaining, but it finished 1 1. And on balance, that was probably the right result. Steve Cuss will be extremely pleased with, that, with, with, with the performance of his players, though, and none more so than Jamie Davidson. Next up for Wimborne is in two weeks' time when we're at Tiverton, and we'll see you there. Man of the match today? Well, for that screamer, it couldn't be anybody else but Jamie Davidson. I've got Steve Cuss with me now after today's exciting 1-1 draw at the Cuthbury with Polton Rovers. Steve, Polton are a team on a roll. You must be absolutely thrilled with that performance and the result. Yeah, definitely. Um, I thought we deserved it as well, but it was a you know, good performance. I've got very confidence during the second half and uh, a great strike got us equalised. It was a great strike. I, I didn't yeah. think Jamie was having his best ever game, but he's such a talented player, isn't he? You never know what he can do. I think it was, it was quite difficult for us to pass it out there today. Um, the pitch is good, but it was, it's a bit dry and a bit bumpy. Um, and they pressed us really hard, so it was, it was quite difficult to pass it. Of course, that's Jamie's game, but yeah. you know, Jamie's always got that in his locker to be able to do that, so we're, we're delighted it's come off for him today. Right. Steve, thanks very much for your time. Thank you.